What's up, dogs? With baseball season knocking on our doors, we invited everybody's favorite teacher, or as many may know, as many may know him, Coach Dudley, to get preview for this upcoming season. So, how are we doing this morning? Doing great. Happy to be here. Good. That's awesome. So, uh, I think the first question that everybody wants to know is, how long have you been coaching? Uh, this is my 21st year at Frankfurt, and then I uh, had two years before this at Park Tudor. Two years. Yeah. Is this your favorite place then? Absolutely. I'm, I think I'm a lifer now. Yeah. Yeah. What, what keeps you here? Um, you know, I enjoy the atmosphere. I enjoy the, the type of players that we have, the, the way the community um, is built well, especially for a baseball program. I like that we're a, a gritty group of guys that I think we rally around some of the obstacles we have to overcome, and um, it makes it a, a fun atmosphere to, to coach in. Yeah. Yeah, I think, I think the baseball program has always been good, and I think you have a big hand in doing that. So, yeah. I know uh, you guys had a big year last year, falling short one game from winning the conference. How do you plan on to improve off that or maybe win conference this year? Well, I think the biggest jump for us this year is we set to be more consistent. We were good last year. When we played well, we could beat anyone. Um, but we had some games where we just had trouble getting momentum going. Our pitching depth is really good. We should be good defensively. We should have a really good mixture of experience and new players and young guys. So um, I, I just think it's the head just being consistent. Yeah. Stemming off that, do you have some key players you want to talk about? Anybody? Or? Yeah, I think um, it, for us it's going to start with our pitching staff. Um, we have a, really almost an embarrassment of riches on the mound, I think, guys that can get, get people out. We have, um, I think, our, our main conference starters, um, Austin Penry, um, Brian Valdez and Jose Lopez all have experience pitching in big games for us, so they're going to get most of the, the conference starts and the big games, you know, post postseason kind of stuff. Uh, Carlos Lopez was instrumental last year out of the bullpen. He's going to be a, a big arm for us um, in those key moments. And then just a lot of depth with, with the rest of those guys. And um, offensively, we should be good up and down the lineup. Um, like I said, a lot of guys returning, a couple of new guys that bring some exciting you know, things to the table. So yeah. What are you expecting this season? Do you have like any goals say, in mind or any goals for the guys or as a uh, team? One thing I've found being here, the longer I'm here, setting a, a, if our goal is to win conference, I mean, of course we want to win conference. Of course we want a sectional more than a sectional. Um, but our goal is that we take every game, that's the most important thing to us. So whatever game we have today, that's it. You know, um, that we get better every game. We don't make, we don't repeat our mistakes when we, you know, go out and, I don't know, maybe don't play well defensively, have trouble throwing strikes, we go back to drawing board, we fix those problems, and we are better every time we take the field. If we do that, everything else takes care of itself. Right. I know a big thing this year is that new sectional that we're in. So tell me on that. What, tell yeah, me about it's that. kind of a monster, but we're excited about it. Yeah. Um, you know, Western's really good and deep. They've got some, some big arms and guys that can play. Um, Northwestern's always good. West Lafayette's always good. Benton Central's always good. So it's a good deep sectional. Um, North Montgomery moved with us to, up to that sectional, and they're going to be really good this year, have a couple of good arms. But one thing we've always thrived on is the big moment. We've, I think some of it's just our guys handle that stuff well. They don't get overwhelmed. They just, they just go and play. So it doesn't matter if the guy on the mound's committed to Louisville or it's you know somebody from down the road in Rossville. We, we approach the game the same way, and that's really important in baseball because you have a chance if you play the game that way. Right. And staying on that topic of new, I know you guys got to – couple new members joining the teams. You want to tell me about the new coaching staff? Um, yeah, it's, it's just some different roles. Um, so, so with the varsity, um, Leo Lopez is, is going to be full-time now, former player, former All-State player, um, brings a lot to the table. So he's helped out from time to time before, but he's, he's a little more full-time now. Um, uh, Omar Alani is going to bounce back and forth, help with some varsity, um, help with some JV, former player, caught for us you know, on a couple of sectional championship teams. Um, and then uh, there's a couple other guys that are part-timers. Um, Kansas Varner, who again, um, instrumental in very successful teams for us, had a good college career. Um, Kansas is going to help with outfielders. Uh, Coach Jewell will be with the JV again. Um, and then uh, Steve Royer is going to help him. So really, really good, talented coaching staff with a wide background of, you know, um, college baseball, good, good experience with us here, know what we're all about. So I'm excited about that. Yeah, bring bring a lot of experience into the team. You know, yeah, the yeah, not just experience, but guys that have been around the program. They understand what we're about. Um, they understand what the strength of our program is. So that, that's exciting to keep those guys in the program. Right. So what's the schedule looking like this year? Uh, we open up 
on April 1st, the end of spring break, a doubleheader against West Lafayette. So that's always a good opportunity to get out, get some different arms on the mound, um, you know, work out some kinks. We, you know, go out and play some good baseball. We, we, then we, the following week, we uh, play Rossville at home, another really good program. So we're excited. You know, we get some good non-conference, some strong non-conference opponents this year. Um, we, we have a, a, a doubleheader with uh, Central Catholic and University. Um, to the best 1A programs in the state. So we, we, we're going to jump right in and, and get some experience before conference gets going. Right. I think I speak for everybody and when I say we're excited. We're excited for this season. And I really want to see what you guys bring to the table this year. Yeah, I hope to see some students out at the field. But, you know, it's, a, it's a fun when you get a group of guys out there and hanging out. And um, So we'll hopefully get some good weather for you guys, and I look forward to it. Yeah. Well. There you go, Odd Dogs. The first baseball game is April 1st against West Lafayette, while the first home game is April 4th against Rossville. It's pretty much, that pretty much does it. You want to add anything else? Nope, I think we're good. Awesome. Well, thanks for coming on down. Yep, thanks. Yep.